This is an important message for all my strong MAGA supporters. I'm not doing it through the fake news tonight. I need to talk directly to our great patriots. As you know, we are under attack. We're under vicious and nasty attack from the left. Law and order is collapsing. And they are using a very special, very nasty new weapon called soup. You know, we used to have a thing called soup kitchens. Not a lot of people know this, but it would be where the people who didn't have food, you know, kind of not hardworking people, they'd go and get the free soup and you'd keep it in a big, like a big bucket, a bowl, pot, a big pot. And, you know, you'd dip the, the spoon, the big spoon, the big, Mike, what's it called? The ladle, the ladle. That's a funny word. You'd dip it in the, the ladle and you'd pour it out, but nobody could take the soup with them. It was safe in the big pots. And now recently, probably under Obama, they invented something called soup cans. And don't get me started on bags of soup. They swing a bag of soup, you're, you're a goner. That's one of the nastiest ways to go. But now they have cans of soup. And Mike, I know you said you hate cans, right? When mother walks in in a tight shirt, you tell her you hate the cans. Not a, not a fan of cans, Mike. He knew. He knew right away. But they're using soup as a weapon against us, and we're defenseless. All we have are assault weapons and, you know, insanity on our side. They have unlimited soup, unlimited quantities of soup, and they come in three varieties, and you got to look out for all of them. Campbell soup, which is kind of the poor people soup and the cans are kind of little. They can still hurt, but you got to be careful. And then Progresso, okay? We know what that sounds like, progressive. It's a nasty liberal soup. You get hit with one of those, it's like getting hit by the whole squad with their socialism. And last, watch out for Chunky Soup, used and endorsed by many African-American NFL players with the big chunks. Very tough. So get your weapons.